Hello everyone, welcome to episode 18 of Franbo. I'm joined with Paul. Hello. <laughs> Hello. We're going to try to cut off his shoes. I mean, his feet. I think rip them off is what you meant. I, I'm pretty sure the wizard, if you brought the shoes back to the wizard with like bloody mantis boots in it, he probably wouldn't be, or he wouldn't be happy about that. Can I change this season? There you go. Okay, he's dancing now. That's not gonna work. Is there anything else you can click in the room? The mask? I'm very. Uh, a Varex of ours. Looks very old. I never saw such a huge moth. Any of these? Hello! Hello, how are you? <laughs> oh no, Mr. Antonio! No, he's like, do you know Mr. Antonio? Oh. She is like that. I'm fine, do you know, uh, by any chance, the certain Mr. Antonio, the greatest? Do you want to do it? Oh, of course, he was a huge trumpeter a few years ago. My mother loved his music. Oh, so he was real. I saw him in the human world. He's very old now. Really? The human world? Well, you know. When we grow old, we all go visit other realities to see if we miss something. Oh, that's why he was there in my reality. We humans don't do that, I think. It was quite fun. I love to get letters from my mother. She tells me many things. <laughs> it does sound fun. We'll have to keep going. Have a nice day. Hello, sir. Hello. <laughs> and bye. Goodbye. Wonder what kind of insect he is. Must be something that he haven't discovered yet or something. I don't want to talk to him. It looks like she's imagining things. I won't bother her when asking what. Sometimes we need to be left alone to imagine things. Hmm, I won't bother them now. Hello, miss. Are you having a great time? <laughs> have you seen my ticket? <laughs> um, I think I have to go. Okay. How about the bartender? Hello. Hey, hello, you came in. How nice. Are you enjoying the show? Yes, very much, but I need the shoes of the dancer. I don't know how to get them. <laughs> so you like to dance. He's a very good dancer. I've never seen him fall. It's mm, very low so bar he sets there for success. I've got an idea. Okay. So he's like the very best dancer of the world. The world, I'd say the universe. He always follows the rhythm. I see. Well, thank you. I have to go. Well, because he kept mentioning lemonade, what if we get a lemon and put it under his feet? So he trips. You could try. Because he kept mentioning it. I don't know why he would mention it. He also said something about the rhythm, so maybe if you could affect the band, or the piano, or the trumpet or something. I thought that guy's trumpet was the key, <laughs> but it's a... Yeah. Right. Okay. Let's do what you did last time, so... There. He didn't... He didn't drop Well, one. we must have got the lemon we needed then for the puzzle, otherwise they would have given us another one. We can follow them in there. Yeah. Is there anything we can do if we go... If if we stay in here and make it summer, maybe? Because the, the place was there in the summer, right? Yeah, yeah. Or spring. Spring. Because we're in summer right now. So I'll change it. Can you go right to spring? It's closed. Oh. Can you send Mr. Midnight in there? Go. I can't find so much again now. Kitty's tired of being illegal. Um. Can you go straight from one month to another, though? Do you have to go through the circle like you did? Can you go uh, from, like... No, you have to go through it. Hmm. Something to knock him off his feet. Something to knock him off his feet. I'm 
do you think we could use? <gasps> Poo! <laughs> My tiny shop, it smells really funny. Hello! Oh, we've already done this. I bet you it's got to be in the bar place. I just do this real quick. Oh, that's okay. I mean, if, if, yeah. I'm, I, I'm only saying that because you said you've seen all this before. Yeah. Because usually, if it's something different, they'll give you a different kind of dialogue scenario. tree right away. You just like reading about eating poo. I see. How yeah, it is. I love gross. it so much. Nasty, if you ask me. Mm. Delish. To the bar we go. Okay, what are we missing, or what aren't we missing? Can you talk to the band? Because they said something about rhythm. I think that was the clue. Hello. Hello. Would you like to autograph? What's the trumpeter doing, sir? Ah, he's fixing the piano. The rhythm must be perfect, so we can start the show. I see, thank you. Hmm. That was so That's gotta be the key, the key then, right? Yeah. Because they said something about rhythm earlier. Curious. The self playing piano has a door down there, I'm curious. That's gotta be the clue right there. Yeah, what can we use though? I don't know. I would. I thought before. Can you go backwards instead of going forward for the seasons? I don't think so. No. Won't bother them now. Um. If they were ever stop, okay, I won't bother them. Hmm. Go through all the seasons again. That's gonna throw us out. Go through the seasons again. Don't move. Just see if anything changes. Oh. Um. I know it's a long shot, but if you go into winter. Yeah. Can you stand over where the place is more? Or if you go into the other one on the left? Should we go back to the um, main place and see if there's anything we're missing? Yeah, you can. I'm pretty sure it has to do with the bar, though. You light them on fire? That's not right, no! <laughs> no, because moths oh, like fire. God. No, moths like fire. I thought you were going to be like, well, when they're all watching the burning moth, we can go fuck with the piano. I was going to be like, no! Done. Would you like a crayon? Would you like a. We must have it for a reason still. What about you? Well, if we give it back to him. There you go. Here's your ticket, miss. I'm sorry, but I took it, but I want to give it back. Oh, goodness! You're very nice, thank you! The kind thief. The dancer is fabulous! <laughs> they me. Are there any other... Hmm? Are there any other controls on our... On your... Weather watch? No. What if you do it really quickly? I know it's like... So where do you want me to go? Spring. Spring is green. Every time, Paul. <laughs> Every time. Let's fuck around with this. Ooh. That's blue. <laughs> well, so we need to make it orange? So make it red and blue. Click both of those, right? Because there we go, purple. What is it? Now turn off the blue and add the yellow? No, no, no. Oh, my, my bad. 
Well, that's how for him. Okay, that's what we needed, right? Yeah. Okay, there we go. That's not a real piano, it's just a label. Like... That's gonna set the rhythm up really high on the player piano. Yes, yeah, that's what we want. Over. At least I think that's what we want. Dance for us! <laughs> Holy crap! <laughs> He's gonna have a heart attack. <laughs> Get his shoes! Oh my god, did he die? Oh no. <laughs> they might have, they dragged him off. Oh god. I have his shoes, I'm so clever. He did horrible things. Yes, I did, and I loved it. Deal with it. I can't believe that. That's. How are you gonna explain that to the wizard? I'm not going to explain it. No one saw it. I just got them. He was being helpful towards me. There you go. Sir, sir, I have the shoes. They're very pretty. Look. Well, you did it! You've an extra no ordinary machine inside your head. I had a hard time with words. Thank you, sir. Now, let's see the last one so I can go home. The last one, eh, uh, hmm, I recognize this feather. It belongs to Palodontras. Yes, I saw him very injured. Hmm, he will be fine. Here's the pink water. That can fix everything. Yes, that's true. Well, what do we do with the feather? Uh, go visit the old Valkyrie's mechanical dial. My wand will be there. I have to finish my rabbit science. I think I have the answer. Oh, okay, sir. I'll bring you your wand back. Thanks. I'm such a mug. <laughs> Let's go get this as well. Well, it is a pretty big task, probably having him turn us into a human. Oh, I see the wand. Let's see how it works. So you can, you can conduct a symphony with it? Oh, I bet you have to use one hand to give it to the other one, right? So the hand's there. I need that hand to move up. Well, there's one hand that can. There's one lever, lever that controls that hand, right? Which one? This one. I don't know. <laughs> Click on one, and we'll find out. So okay, we'll it's probably the upper right, it's probably the most upper right handle, I guess. It probably it. corresponds with that arm. There you go. And then... What other positions can you put that in? Down and up. Okay. And this one goes over here. And here. Alright, so bottom right one, move up. This one. Now how do you make it grab it? Can you touch the top lever? Oh, that's not lever. Mm -mm. See the one. Let's see how it works. Now move the top right one again, then I guess. This one? See if we'll hand it off. Bottom right one. There. There we go. Okay, and then. Now top left one. This one. And that one. Yep, in the bottom. That was a joint effort, I think. Yoink. <laughs> right, I'm back. Do, do, no, up there. God damn you. Guess what, wizard? We've got your magic wand, and that's the one in your pants. Ooh. It's like I don't wear pants. He doesn't. Here's your wand, sir, wizard. Oh, hey, magnificent, splendid, you did it. Really? But oh, where are wizard. the stones? <laughs> <laughs> Can I borrow them? I can't lend you the stones. These stones are very, very special. What I can do is place the stones on the locks of the door, but you... You are the only one who can turn the key and actually open the door. Oh, I see. The king told me he would uh, show me where the door is. Ah, then we should go and talk with him, don't you think? We gotta oh. be made human first, don't we, by yeah. him? Yeah. Wait, I suspect you can't return home looking like a tree. Oh, no, I almost forgot. Yes, you're right. Can you bring me back my human body? Yes, I can. This is exciting. I haven't done this in hundreds of years. Let's make a human, yes? Give me your clothing. I need to smell it. 
Here's uh, my clothing. That's creepy. Mm, let me smell this. Oh, this can work. We will make you human. Oh, this is so exciting. Good. Now go to the center of the star of my fist. Uh, fist just, uh, and think about your body, your head, your leg, and the other leg, and your third leg, and your arm, both of them. Now concentrate. Randomly selected elements find your path to your true essence. Become Fran the human now! Yeah, yeah! Um. Uh oh. Don't tell me this is how the game ends. <laughs> well. Huh? Are you alright? What happened? Is it done? Oh, wow! Thank you so much, sir. You're a great wizard. Yes, that's my name, Great Wizard, because of the greatness. Hmm. I think we have to go to the king now, so he can show me the door. Yes, I'll be right there. I have to finish something. I'll be there. Go now. Yeah, yeah. I got my body back. I like that. You're <laughs> like, let's not travel in winter. Yeah. I don't like I wonder the what the king's been doing all this time. Dancing. You killed that poor mantis, I'm pretty sure. I didn't. I don't know. What the hell? You can be her. I don't like her. No, I think that's alternative Fran, because she's got a Mr. Midnight, too. Everything is fine. They look like Pan's Labyrinth. Labyrinth. <laughs> the hands. Yeah, I love that movie. Everything is fine. It feels like heaven. What are you? Leave Mr. Midnight alone. Is your head playing with you again? Can't you see yourself in the mirror? It's not you. I'm not. Let Mr. Midnight go now. We kill the traitors, because that's what he is, Fran, don't you see? Mr. Kitty is not a traitor. He promised to be by my side. He promised. As your mummy and daddy did, who promised to take care of you. Wake up, Fran. You're surrounded by traitors. Leave me alone. Leave my friend alone. I'm the only one you have, Fran. I'm the only one who's always will be by your side. Now let's get rid of this traitor, eh? What did you say? Let's be happy. Let's be so very, very happy together. No, no, no. Go away! It wasn't me. That's really sad. Hey, what's up, guys? No. How's it going? Fred, what's wrong? Why are you crying? I'm crazy, sir. I'm totally crazy. The doctors are right. But you're not crazy. I'm very sorry that you feel that way. You should be happy now. You found the stones and became human again. This is very great indeed. My dear, let me wipe those tears. I don't want to hurt you, my dear. And I feel like I'm about to do it at any moment. You won't. I know it because you love me. Yes, Kitty, I do love you very, very much. Fred, remember what I told you. If you love your life. And that is the only thing that matters. You will always find the power to fight those monsters in you. I'm choked up. Now let's go and open the gate so you can go home. Yes, let's do it. Alright. Hurry up, would you? Bye. Hey, bug guard. Hey, king. <laughs> Here we are. Is that a door? Yes, but where's the door? Alright, I gotta make it visible. But are you sure you wanna go back? I'm sure, sir. Alright, here we go. The human must leave. Open the secret door into a reality. Let the human return home. Bam. Oh wow, we're going home, kitty. The hell? It's a wizard. Ho oh, oh, ho, yeah. Sarah the Great, good to see you. I brought the stones so this lovely creature can go home. 
Thank you, sir. I'm very nervous. It'll be strange to be far away from you all. Don't leave. I can make you a place to stay. A magical place. Wizard, she's gotta leave. I received a message from one of the Voloka, Volokas. She's she's not ready. Not at all. Oh, I see. What are you talking about? Ready for what? Come, wizard. Place the stones. We have no time to lose. But ready for what? You know what the Valakas told you about facing your truth? Oh yes, I think I remember. Well, should I? Yes, go ahead, wizard sir. Magic stones create the lock that only the human can break. Samples! Well, now it's time for friend to be the key. You are the only one who can open this now. Oh, wow, all right, let's see. Is that because he can't figure out the puzzle? Yeah. Oh god, I suck at these kind of puzzles. Well, you figure out which one the first one needs to be. This one. And then this one. So this one. Oh, I bet it's the red one. I bet it's the red one it's shooting at. This one. And this one. And this one. And then this. No, and then this one. And then this one. There. I like colors. <laughs> I smell victory again! You did it, friend! You can go home now! I'm so excited! Bye. No. I wish I could leave you something so you can remember me. We won't forget you, you're a very special creature. I almost forgot. Oh! Mm -hmm. Sorry. Oh, I almost forgot. Balloon Trust gave me this for you. Oh, yay! Some sort of puzzle box. Yay! Just what I wanted. Tell Platonius that I wish I could help him with his wounds. I gave my eight patches to a girl in the hospital, but anyway. I'll tell him, don't worry, Balloon Trust is better now. Oh, before you go, you must know. Before you return to your reality, you will go through the secret woods. The woods are a kind of invisible passage between our realities. And, and you may encounter terrible creatures that want to eat you. Probably don't let them do that. But just run, they're quite a sh they're quite slow really. They're not fast. And you're telling me this now? That sounds so scary. Don't worry, you'll do fine. <laughs> Hope so. Mr. Midnight, say goodbye. Let's go now. Bye, Kitty. Goodbye, gentlemen. I had a great time. I think we should stop this right here before we go through the door. Alright. Yes. Thank you. This is such a touching goodbye. Goodbye, Mr. Wizard and Mr. Creepy King. And everyone else. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you guys for watching us, and we'll see you soon. See you later.